This is Sean and Sue's podcast on 92.7 WOBM. The Ocean County Breakfast Show with Sean Michaels and Sue Ball. Ocean County's best variety. 92.7 WOBM. Service at simplemobile.com. 92.7 WOBM. Sean Sue with you on a Thursday morning. Nancy's with us real quick. Nancy. While we were on vacation. Uh, the wife, uh, mm-hmm. my daughter, and my son's girlfriend went to a fish spa, <laughs> and they put oh their boy. feet in the feet. tank. Yeah. What all do you right. think They're of that? They're not rubbing fish all over your body. No. No, the fish eat your... The, <laughs> the eat skin. The skin off your face. The, the, the scaly skin that. or something I've like seen that. This. I would not, because I always think that fish is pulling germs in from other feet. No, I would not get it, if that's what you're asking. Nance? <laughs> you wouldn't I, do it. I don't really get your reasoning, but no, what it just would not. What if the fish are eating at your feet, Nancy, and then you have an infection, and then that fish takes a bite at my feet? <laughs> that's what I'm <laughs> oh saying. That infection, then, will get into my feet. In in Sioux world, yes. Well, in, in real world, I don't they don't change so. the fish out. Okay. And what's in the fish after eating your feet, that feet... They were laughing, Is though. You, they said yeah. it tickled. They said it tickled. They yeah. were laughing. They were giggling. I wouldn't uh, like it, though. Yeah. You, we would like it's little. Not, no, what did their feet look like, like after? Didn't look like anything. I mean, it just, Were they, like, you know. soft? Yeah, they did feel soft. Very soft. They did put, they smell? First, they clean. No. First, they clean your feet going in. Mm-hmm. So you do go into the tank clean, and they, and they uh, disinfect your feet. Then you go into the tank. Then when you come out, they use special lotions and stuff on your feet mm-hmm. after you're done or whatever. I didn't do it. They liked it. I, I would felt do all of that, but without good. the fish. Yeah, it felt good. But they were <laughs> laughing, a, though. My daughter pick. My daughter said, there's one that's of them. Right. It's just, he's just pulling at my foot. Pulling. He's, he's like, you see? You know, and so. then what they're doing is that fish is pulling her little corn and then putting that corn onto Gross. your foot. Yeah. See, that's she the way I look at it. Corns. Well, uh, people have rough spots on their feet. I have like athlete's feet. (laughs) So what if I'd go in there? They wouldn't let you in there. Yeah, they wouldn't. They would tell me no. They would be scrubbing your feet and they would notice that you have... Oh my gosh, that's not uh, true. You have fungus. How bad is your athlete's foot? Oh, I get itchy in between the toes. Really? Yeah. Do you have a lot of like green? It's split. (laughs) How about... It's what? It's split? It's split. Can we move on? It's All split. Right, I, I, I have trouble have... even thinking of the fish, this and you're giving normal. me much more information Athlete's than I want. feet is normal. Do you have like, but I don't want to talk about it. Do you it. have okay. like those big toenails, like those big, like crunchy well, toenails? Yeah. I have to, yeah, dig well, yeah. down and. What? You have to do what? Dig down. And... <laughs> All right. Nance. Dig. Nance. <laughs> Nance. You're letting him ask you these. Help you. Help me. Oh, my gosh. I tried. I do have to share something with you guys. No. No. Can I share something? No. I have to go. This report is brought to you by Peapod. (laughs) I am doing this report. What are you picking? I love picking up my toes. I'm a huge picker. All right. I'm doing this report. You want me to help you? I'm doing this report. (laughs) I'm sorry. Brought to you by Peapod. We have a Route 9. Very busy at this point as you're making your way out through to Stevens Road and Church Road. WOBM, good morning. Good morning, Sean and Sue. Hi, honey. All right, so your favorite diner. Give it to us. I like Paul's Diner in North Jersey. Paul's Diner. Or, or there's one near Wall near uh, the Farmingdale Stars with Circle. A historic one. Well, how are you guys doing, man? I'm doing good. Bud hey, McCormick. Bud. How are you? <laughs> good. I'm on my way to the inaugural. Oh. Are you really? Yes. I'm trying to look up what diner here. I got Wall Street <laughs> Diner and I've got the Roadside Diner came up. So, I don't yeah, know. Maybe I think the... it's the Roadside. Road All right. Side. Thanks, bud. Thanks, bud. He's on his way to the uh, inaugural down yeah, at Washington. That Sioux. is so cool. All right. Give That's us a cool. call. What is your favorite diners? We want to hear from you and check out the story at WOBM.com and on Facebook. WOBM, good morning. We're talking favorite diners. What's your favorite? My favorite diner um, is uh, the Vincent Town Diner. Oh, yes. Yes, out there in, um, what is that? Uh, is that Cranberry? Vincent no. Ta- yeah, Vincent Town. It's out by Columbus. Right. Yeah, Burlington County. One of the best. It is very good. Yeah? Okay. Fantastic. It was on uh, Diners, Divers, and Jives. Oh, uh, cool. Yeah. Do they have dried yeah. beef gravy, do you Delicious. know? Delicious. Delicious. Cool. A lot of organic Delicious. food you used out, there. You come out and you fall down on your face. <laughs> <laughs> what town are you from? 
I'm from Manchester. My name is Dolly. Have a good day. Hello, Dolly. We're going to say goodbye, Dolly. <laughs> Take care. Bye, Dolly. All right, give us a call. Check out the story at WOBM.com and Facebook. Favorite so diners. corn and cheese in I the know. morning. Okay. I love it. Makes Speaking a good muffin. Yeah. 732 wobm WOBM, good morning. Favorite diners. What's yours? The bandwagon. What town? Tom's River. Also called Mr. Breakfast. Miss, yes. Yes. That's what it is. Yes. Wagon. It's right. on the way. Yep. On Thank the way you to for Seaside. your call. Have a great day today. Right. Give us a, a call care, if you'd like to uh, tell us your favorite diner, Sue, or check it out online. It's at WOBM.com. WOBM, good morning. We're talking favorite <laughs> diners. What's your favorite? Good morning, Sean and Sue. My favorite here in Mama County is the all season in Eaton Town. It's a very good one. I've been there. I've eaten there. It's delicious. Isn't it great? It sure very is. Nice, very nice. Very I'll nice look for people. you next time, honey. <laughs> All right, I hope to see you there. <laughs> All righty. Thanks, Mary from Long Branch calling in today. Uh, give us a call. Another one in Long Branch. Amy's Omelet House is on the list, Sue, as far as favorite diners, too. So okay, check out cool. the story. It's at WOBM.com, Facebook as well, or pick up the phone and give us a ring. 732 WOBM. WOBM, good morning. Good morning. Welcome back, Sean. Thank you. Thank you. I wanted to talk to Sue. She's not here right now. <laughs> okay. I think well, she I, I think she may be out picking her toes. I'm not quite sure. <laughs> I wanted to remind her that some people are having breakfast at this time. <sighs> but that being said, <laughs> I cannot go to bed without getting the fuzz out be front from be in between my toes. Oh my god. Oh god. Uh. <laughs> But so I'm you're... not picking at them all day long. It's just get the fuzz out to go to sleep. Uh, Sue's digging, she said. You remember I she, heard. She said digging. So. Does she use tools? <laughs> I don't know. I don't even want to know. What town are you from? Bayville. Oh, I'm glad you got clean toast. Thanks for calling in today. Hey. All right. Sue's feet. She's a picker. She's admitted to it. Um, and this woman saying that, you know, she's getting the fuzz. Oh, boy. Thanks for joining us this morning here on the Yoshi County Breakfast Show. I love picking up my toes. Traffic watching 92.7 WOBM. All right, thanks a lot, Nancy. We are here with our special co-host today. Mary Malagir is with us. Uh, she is the co-host for the hour, and we're talking about some of her favorite uh, items on her agenda, including the love for the Ocean County Library. We were just talking about the big fundraiser for their mini golf tournament that's happening inside the library Links right here in Tom's with the River. Masters, miniature yeah. golf inside the library, Mary. How cool is that? I think it's great. It's yeah. going to be a fun, you know, fun it's night. fun, fun, fun. Fun two days, yeah. actually. Yes, next yes. weekend. Yeah. Yes. So let's talk about it. The community wants to get involved in this. There's sponsor opportunities. Yes, and there's there ways are, to get Sean. involved. How do we do that? Absolutely. All you need to do is hop online to the Ocean County Library dot org and you'll see the the logo and the links with the masters. Just click on that. It'll take you directly over to the to the page with all the sponsorships listed. And they really are very inexpensive. There's a whole sponsorship available for only three hundred dollars. There's um on the Arnold Palmer sponsorship mm. The award sponsor, the 19th hole sponsor, which, of course, Sue, I know you want to do. Oh, yes. And then, of course, the <laughs> event sponsorship. So all of these things are very much available and very affordable. And there are four tickets that come with all of these sponsorships with the exception oh, of good. the hole sponsorship. So that's really great. So you're expecting a lot of people out there as Absolutely. well. Why not show your business off? Absolutely. Because, you know, you not only get your business promoted or mm -hmm. your theme promoted um, because each hole will of course have prominently display your business and it goes on all of our releases and it's two full days remember that mm -hmm. it's not just the one night of people coming to see that you are a sponsor and a supporter of our fabulous library system because we do Love wonderful it. things for our community every single day and this is an opportunity to show your support. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Well, you want to go to theoceancountylibrary.org for more details. Mary's got other items on her agenda today, Sue. <laughs> We're going to come back. We're going to take a break, but more We're coming like up. Mary's agenda. Mary's agenda. <laughs> it's the agenda of Mary Malagier. We've Can't got it wait. coming up for you next on WOB. You probably hear that at you home know. at Mary's house. <laughs> Mary's agenda. <laughs> Andy, there are a lot of reasons why Lester Glenn sells so many Hyundais month after month. Adam, our. It just doesn't seem right. 
this price <laughs> and she's got the two necklaces and we we, we get out the iphone because we have like a calculator oh yeah uh, like that tells a, you yeah mm -hmm. like it, it converts money or whatever mm -hmm. and and it turns out that it was a thousand dollars of american money oh wow so what we she thought, went really out so wow. what we thought was just like maybe like a hundred you know, dollars for this little, you know, necklace or whatever. It was a thousand dollars. And I tell her, go get two of them, dear. <laughs> so I just got, the, and, and now I'm going to throw my account all out of whack or whatever. Mm -hmm. And she's like, I don't like them that much. She's like, no, I do not like them that oh much. Oh my goodness. Could you return them? So she's like, but I don't want to go back every time. I'm like, oh my God. So I go, we're, we're, we're walking back to the bus. I said to the bus driver, how much time before we leave? He's like, you've got six minutes. <laughs> so I have to run back in and I feel like such a heel. I mean, I literally <laughs> just got done doing this. I said, she changed her mind. And he was like, you know, and then he's talking to the other lady in Icelandic and I don't know what they're saying. And then, <laughs> they're saying this guy's an uh, idiot. Yeah, where this guy, he found out. Because it was funny when, when I bought them, he said, yeah, he said, these, these are funny. He's like, you're the first person to ever buy these. Now I know why, because they were $1,000. <laughs> go ahead, honey, get three. Yeah, get like three of them. <laughs> While you're at it, pick out one nice for every trip. day of the week. I'm going so, away with you next wasn't time. Wasn't that fun? So anyway, that was another little fun experience. So they did that get my account straightened to out, tell. though. That I told her, I said, look, you can keep them if you want. I'm like, please return them. Please return them. <laughs> <laughs> Ninety two point seven WOBM. Good morning, Sean. With you on a Wednesday morning. It is January eighteenth, six thirty eight, forty two degrees. Good to be back with you. Oh, After so being nice away. to have you here. You know, it's uh you know Thank your vacation. Goodness. You've had enough time off when you feel like time okay. To get back. I'm ready to get back to a regular routine. Oh, I enjoyed oh. vacation, loved it. Uh but yeah, now I'm ready to get back to work. But yeah. it was funny. One of the, you know, I I tried to make little mental notes, you okay. know uh while I was where I was monitoring you. And, I um, know you were. We yes. were talking about that on the air that you were monitoring. I was me monitoring from you, Iceland. make sure that everything was okay. Just oh, for you know, sake. did everything sure. go all right? Yeah, you were fine. Mm -hmm. You know, so I can listen right. I was listening right online. It's <laughs> crazy. Um, but anyway, uh, one of the funny things that happened while we were away, mm -hmm. we were going out to see the Northern Lights, and they told us it's going to be really cold. This was a nighttime excursion, although there wasn't much daylight there anyway. Okay, but it was a nighttime excursion, really cold really windy snow. We we're going to be out there outside for like four hours. Mm -hmm. So it was going to be a long night. Wow! So we decided to bring, we brought our ski bibs with us, our ski pants. So we're in um, my uh, son's apartment, his uh, hotel room, okay. getting changed because that's where the bus was going to pick us up. We were kind mm -hmm. of all at different little locations. Anyway, so long story short, I'm, I'm putting on my ski pants and I'm like, my goodness, I must be eating like a horse out here. You can't wear I them? can't even fit in my ski pants. <laughs> oh. They are so tight. I'm trying to zip them up and I'm pulling and I'm pulling and I'm like, oh my, this is embarrassing. But at least my my you know my uh, winter coat is long. It's one they of those- They could cover it. A big Columbia yeah. jacket, mm -hmm. so it'll you know they won't even be able to tell. Although they're going to be falling down the whole time I'm out there because I can't even you know put them together. I can't even zip them up and, oh, and, and button them. Okay. So I come out and I'm walking like the Tin Man in, in the Wizard of Oz because my pants are so tight <laughs> and I'm like my God. So my wife is getting it comes in and she's just got changed. She's like I can't even keep these pants on. They're so big. No, you they're each falling pants. down. She's they're they're falling off of her. She looked like she was she. Shrunk Trunk. The thing is, they're both black. They're both identical. I had hers on. She had she mine had on. She had yours. That's <laughs> funny. I almost ripped them on her, oh. and, it was, and everybody was laughing. They because they're you know they're black. They're, they're the same thing. And uh, but I had hers on, and it was just like, oh, for goodness. <laughs> <laughs> keep your own pants on. I said, well, I, I hope I warmed them up for you, huh? Oh, that's funny. I almost hurt myself. <laughs> <laughs> 92.7 WOBM. Good morning, Sean Sue, with you on this Wednesday morning. Good to be back together again. We're together for a few days before then you go on vacation. Yes, that's right. So I'm so. glad we're able to spend this little bit of time <laughs> Couple together. Of days together. And then you'll be on vacation. Well, radio is weird if people don't know. We have certain times where we're actually only allowed to take off mm. you know what i mean so this is the time when we're allowed usually we're not allowed to take off <laughs> but this is when we can yeah. so that's why we sort of have to cram in mm -hmm. our vacation in like yeah. literally like four weeks yeah. only in the year
One of the things I did while I was away on vacation, yeah. there was a waterfall. Uh, we saw a couple waterfalls, but there was one they of the were waterfalls. Gorgeous. Yeah, I, they were. I, if you're lucky enough to follow Sean on Facebook or Instagram, you got to see some of these. Yeah, some of the pictures from Iceland. Mm-hmm. And the one waterfall I was, um, you know, they they it was on a you know the side of a mountain. They had the steps okay. that you could climb up to the top of the waterfall. Really? And I was the only one could in our group. Could you jump down? No, jump. Well, I didn't <laughs> if know. you if you if you had a you know a bad day. Maybe. Oh, 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 uh, you oh, know, oh you like think, that. Yeah. Like no rope jumping. That no. seems like fun. No, 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 okay. no. You jump off this waterfall. It's the last waterfall you're jumping off of. Um, <laughs> but uh, I decided I was the only one who wanted to go climb the waterfall. So I start my trek up the side of this mountain. Right. And it took a while to get up there. I mean, in those short little steps oh, and everything. Mm-hmm. And it kept getting higher and higher. And I was like, I started looking down at certain points. And Crazy. it was like cliffs and stuff. And I was like, Ooh. Well, you're not too you keen know. on heights. Yeah, I wasn't. I don't mm. know why. So I don't know why. I, I just decided i'm gonna go up there and get photos you are an adventurer yeah so i went up there and um and 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 i get to the top and i didn't realize that the platform that's out there you could see through it like so you could see down below so one of the uh, couples that was on our tour with us Mm -hmm. asked me to take a picture of them with their iphone but it meant that I had to go all the way out onto the platform <laughs> did you do it? to get the picture. And I didn't want them to think that I wouldn't do it. Mm-hmm. So chicken, I did go chicken. out. Yeah, exactly. Mm-hmm. So I inched my way out. I'm like, oh, my God. Oh, my word. Can you imagine if you would have dropped their phone, too? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, no. that, that would have been the least of my problems if I dropped their phone. Because I would have been you know, worried oh, about no. falling out myself. But I got the picture done for them. And they were Good. very happy. And then I slowly, slowly Oof. turned inch by inch. I don't know if I could have done made my that. Way back off there but we were really up high but the thing that astounded me was a guy was coming up the side of the mountain and he had his baby strapped to his back oh no and this was a newborn and i thought to myself i was having just such a hard time myself and i thought why would you i could never have put one of the kids on my back i'd have been so worried that they would have fallen off the back of me or what if i fell you know what i mean then there's two of us going off the side of the cliff so i just i was really amazed that he uh had the baby strapped to his back but uh, that was on the way down that i saw how amazing is that though sean so i made my way down really quick down the steps i don't think um, i could do it it was uh, definitely a thrill to be up there (laughs) My hands would have been sweating. I still haven't looked at all the photos with my regular camera from up there, but there's a few that I took b- <laughs> before it was like, I gotta get out of here. You should have been gone! I love picking up my toes. Thanks for listening to Sean and Sue's podcast on 92.7 WOBM. For more details, go to WOBM.com.